The day has finally come. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Brianna and today I am filming the long awaited, way overdue room tour. You guys have been asking for this video for so long. I'm so sorry it took so long. I was just waiting to make my room like perfect because there's so many things I wanted to do to it. But I just wanted to get this video out for you guys. Um, there's a lot of changes that I want to make but this is my room for right now. Um, yeah, let's get into it. I hope you guys enjoy. I'm going to try to go fast because I feel like room tours are always like unnecessarily long. Okay, let's go. Okay. Okay, I guess we'll start with a little bit of an overview. This is my room. You guys have seen it a lot through all my videos and my TikToks and stuff. And then we are back at the door. I guess I'll start here. This is my little bag hanger. I got it from Amazon. I'll link everything in the description that I can find. Um, I just have some of the bags that I reach for the most. So we have like tote bags, purses, and things like that. It is very full. Um, you come over here and we have my Playboy poster. I got this from Redbubble, I believe. Um, I used to have like butterflies hanging up here, but they fell down when I turned my fan on. So now we just have the poster. But right here I have my little ukulele. Um, over here we have my whiteboard. My mom got this for me when I was little when my sister and I shared a room But we just painted the frame pink and I have like expo markers a little banner I feel like it'd be really good to like write to-do list or something on but my friends wrote on it And I can't get it off without like the expo marker spray So we have that as a memory for now and then I have like a little hello kitty magnet heart magnet and then my photo strip for my birthday party Here's Thumper. He wants to say hi. So this is that little awkward corner of my room. And then you come over here and we have my mini purse wall. Um, sometime when I get more purses, I want to put more right here. But for now, I just have the three. I feel like they fit the wall pretty nicely. Um, so yeah, just some purses from Depop and stuff. And then up here, we have a little shelf, which I'll get to in a second. And my closet. My closet is pretty messy right now. I want to do like a closet clean out video. But I just have some of my clothes clothes and like more skirts down there thumper going through my closet um i have some like memory boxes backpacks i have like accessories and things in these little polka dot bins you can see there's a lot of pink in my closet but yeah that's my closet i'm gonna do a video about it and then if you come to the other side i just have some like memory stuff that's like sentimental in my record collection up there it's kind of small um more jackets and things up here i have like my little getting ready station so like a bunch of lotions and then i also keep like candles and stuff up here this is my situation for now. I actually can fit a lot of clothes in there, surprisingly. So up here, we have a bunch of bathing suits. We've got a lot of those. This one is like workout clothes. They're kind of unorganized again. This one is like my pajama drawer. So I have a bunch of like pajama sets and like PJ pants. These smaller ones are socks and underwear, and then we have jeans. I really folded them in here, but it's kind of nice because you could, like, see everything you're looking at. This one is, like, sweatshirts and hoodies, and then the bottom one... Oof, I actually have no idea what's in the bottom one. Oh, the bottom one is onesies, which I actually need to find a better space for those. I have a bin of like shoes I don't wear as much right here. Um, I want to fit a shoe rack in here. So once I get rid of this big bin of clothes that has like Depop orders and stuff or like stuff I need to list on Depop, um, I want to fit a shoe rack in here so I could like see everything. But let me know if you guys want to see in like a in-depth closet tour because I can definitely do that for you guys. Uh, we come up here to this little shelf. Um, I just have a super old photo from high school for my cheer team because they gave me that frame and I just spray painted it pink. Um, I have like stuffed animals, corsage, a little Tiffany and Co bag. Um, these things were all gifts, so I just kind of keep them up there for sentimental purposes. I have some books right here. The Connor Francia one is really random. I got it when I was like in middle school, and I really liked it at the time, so I put it up here. I have The Sun and Her Flowers, and then this little unicorn is from a claw machine. Um, a succulent plant, a little pink box that's good for like putting more sentimental stuff in. Um, this Marie little stuffed animal is from Disneyland, and then I have an Eiffel Tower from Amazon and it wouldn't fit standing up straight so I had to like lean it and it looks really bad but it's fine um, this book is capture your style and it's kind of about like yeah social media and stuff like that 
I got it when I was really young, which is kind of ironic, but I never read through the full thing, so I really want to do that, but it's a really pretty coffee table book. And then I just have like a string of fairy lights. Yeah, that is my little shelf above my closet. I actually fit so much up there, so it's super nice to have. Next to my closet, we have this little hanging situation going on. So I have my fairy wings from Halloween, and then my little bunny backpack, which I'm so obsessed with, and then my pink earmuffs. I didn't know where to put them, so I just put them on the bunny. Um, right here, we have a little Betsy Johnson slip dress that I hung, just because it's so gorgeous, and I have nowhere to wear it usually so I just like hung it on display as a little decoration don't come for me for having my Christmas tree out still I just feel like it goes super well with my room because it's pink and it's so cute so I feel like I could use it year-round I also want to do a little Valentine's Day tree so I ordered some Valentine's Day ornaments from Amazon and I'm gonna do a Valentine's Day decorating video you come over here and we have my infamous seating area I film like most of my TikToks and videos in front of this wall because it is so cute all of these pictures are actually on my Pinterest on the board called pink so I will link that for you guys. I printed them through Shutterfly and Snapfish and yeah it is super nice. You guys can get a closer look. Um, I can definitely tape them on better but Thumper my bunny tries to like eat them off the wall so they kind of come off a little bit. Um, this little bench thing is from either Wayfair or Overstock.com. I have my Juicy Pillow from Macy's. They also have them on Amazon though. This little Hello Kitty I get so many questions about. It's from CVS during Easter time. So it's like a special edition thing. They'll probably have it again this Easter. And then this little pink rug is from Target. You come over here and we have my favorite giant teddy bear that I was asked out with on Valentine's Day. So that's a good memory to have. Super cute. Um, we come over here to my vanity, which I love, but I actually don't use that much. Um, I have these like hanging flowers going across from Amazon and my little pink cowboy hat which looks super cute up there. Um, this desk I want to say is from Walmart. Don't quote me on that though. I really want to get one of those like mirrors with the lights and everything so I could do my makeup on here. But for now we just have a regular white mirror. Over here this is one of my favorite little areas of my room. So I have these like roses that were gifts in a little vase and then a Tiffany & Co little tower of bags. I put a little tiara on it too because I just felt like it looked cute. Um, I have this perfume tray which I love is from Amazon and then just some of my favorite perfumes that I find myself reaching for the most. These crystal things um, TJ got me as gifts and they're all super cute. And then I put a little You Smell Nice pin that was actually sent to me in a PR package. And I feel like it just goes nice with the theme and it matches the Tiffany bags and everything. I also have like some random little hidden things right here that didn't look as aesthetically pleasing. Just like a bunch of photo strips for my birthday party and like a little jar of pins and paper clips and stuff. Right here, this is like a new area I recently did and I love it so much. We have my little Hello Kitty Polaroid camera that my best friend got me for my birthday. So obsessed with her, like she needs to be on display in my room. This little kiss envelope and then I put it on this little heart platter that I got in the dollar spot from Target and I feel like it's really nice. Um, these orchids I actually got for TJ's mom and I didn't end up seeing her. So now they're in my room but usually I would have like roses or something. Um, I have this this picture frame which is from home goods or Ross I believe it's like cheetah and mirrored um, this mirror was recently sent to me in a PR package but I feel like it's really cute and I like having it there for when I need to do like things that I need a closer look of um, this little heart bowl is also from Target last year around Valentine's Day and I have a bunch of pink candy in it my friend got me even more candy and I love it because it's all pink and it matches so it's really nice for people to grab for like if I ever have people over um, I'm obsessed with the Hershey Kisses so there's like none left and my little bench is also from Target I believe and I have a little wall plug from Minky Candle it has a pink sand scent in it um, oh also these little stickers are me um, I like did like a influencer ambassadorship for a sticker brand and yeah that's me as a sticker which is super cool but yeah I love my little vanity i also have a little hello kitty pouch up here which is super nice i have a little heart stuffed animal and then right here i have all of my shoes i love this area so much the shelf is from ikea 
So I have like a little I Love Paris record up there. And I have these little um, LED lights underneath each shelf. Those are from Amazon. Um, I like to keep like little cards and stuff that I like to grab and read every now and then. But yeah, we have all of my favorite shoes that I grabbed for the most right here. Super convenient spot and they look nice on display. We'll go over here to my nightstand. I have this little tray that is from Amazon and it's super cute. I love it. It looks so cute in photos. Um, on the top one, I just have some of my favorite beaded necklaces, my Dior lip glow and blush, which looks so pretty. Right here, I have my sunglasses and like my Hello Kitty AirPods. And then on the bottom one, I have a sunglasses case, sleeping mask, phone cases, my little juicy wallet. Um, oh, an Urban Outfitters gift card. That's new. Um, and then my Hello Kitty compact mirror and some French lavender. I put this on top of my jewelry box, but I keep the jewelry that I wear the most up here. Like this has like um, earrings and stuff in it. And then this part, I also have stuff in too. But all my main jewelry is up here. Um, here we have a little cactus that's in a Hello Kitty pot. This is from the brand Erin Condren. They did a Hello Kitty collab and they sent me a package, which was so nice of them. But I have this little plant with a little pink flower and then this heart tray came with the other pink one from Target. I have some roses that are dying so probably have to take those out soon and then this book is called Paris Through a Fashion Eye and I'm so obsessed with it because as you guys know Paris is like my dream destination and it has like a bunch of little Paris fashion drawings in it and yeah this is a great book. I got it from Amazon. Over here I have another one of those trays from Amazon. I have my salt rock lamp, a little Hello kitty notepad another succulent um, my hello kitty pez dispenser i didn't know what to do with it so i just put it on display and then we have my yankee candle and some of my favorite rings that i wear like all the time um i actually forgot to put them on today okay i put my rings on because i just realized i forgot to put them on today but this nightstand was actually my mom's when she was a little girl and we painted it white put some new knobs on it um they're kind of unorganized but i have like my hello kitty pen and just like stationery and stuff in here. I actually have a lot of notebooks, like a lot, a lot. Um, this is like my DS from when I was little in a little Hello Kitty case. I have like stuff to make jewelry in there. Um, but yeah, a lot of notebooks. That's basically what's in all these drawers. Up here above my window, I don't know where I got this idea, but during like quarantine the first year, I put all these little designer boxes up here. So I have like Louis, Chanel, Golf Lafleur, and Tiffany and Gucci. And then I just put a little flower garland above it, which I love. Um, we have a Chrome Hearts poster my friend got me. And then we are at my bed. So this is my bed. It looks really small on camera. Um, but I have a white comforter. And then I have these gray silk pillows. And then my sheets are like these pink silk ones from Amazon. I have um, two fur throw pillows. And then I have this pink cheetah one, I believe is from Ross, I want to say. And then this bee pillow is from Urban, and so is this little round one. Um, I just have more sentimental things, stuffed animals that were all given to me as gifts. And then I have my pink little throw blanket, which is from Target. Um, a Squishmallow my sister got me for Christmas. And then I have my laptop right here. Here I have a little poster wall. So I have like a Clueless poster, which is from Amazon. This Betty Boop one is from Walmart. This one and this one are from um, Haas and Hughes. I hope I'm saying that right. And then these ones I literally printed on my printer, all the smaller ones. But I have like Adelia's one, Cosmopolitan, Betty Boop, a little like vintage magazine one, and then a Clueless one. Um, if we come over here, we have this little photo grid thing. This was like my first ever DIY I ever did. I've painted it so many different colors, but I've had this for years. So I have my little Von Dutch hat on it, a little Hello Kitty Hot Wheels, um, and then a bunch of little pictures and stuff. This one's like a little note of like someone I ordered a package from, and they watched my TikTok videos, and I thought that was so cool, so I hung it up. But yeah, a bunch of Polaroids, tons of photo strips from my birthday party, which was super fun. We had a photo booth there but yeah that's my little photo wall i love adding like polaroids and stuff to it um down here the least aesthetically pleasing part of my room is thumper's cage so that's thumper's little cage and then on top of it i tried to like make it blend in and look cute 
he doesn't really need a cage because I don't keep him in it. He just like runs free in my room, but I just have it to keep all of his stuff in. Um, but I have this little stuffed animal from Target that I got for Valentine's Day last year. And I have this Chanel canvas painting. Um, I got this from, I want to say Ross or TJ Maxx again. Over here we have the little box from the Hello Kitty PR package I received. It was just too cute to throw away, so I kept it here for now. Hopefully I'll find something to do with it. On top of it, I just have the pink pink and red heart pillows from Target, and then we have my little pink trash can. That is everything in my room, I think. Here's one last little overview. So that was my room tour. I really hope that you guys enjoyed it and that it was worth the wait, hopefully. I have a lot of fun and exciting video ideas for the next coming month, like Valentine's Day outfit ideas, decorating, and like closet clean out and organization, closet tour. So please subscribe so you don't miss those. Feel free to give this video a like if you enjoyed it and comment down below how your day was and what other video ideas you guys want to see from me. But yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all very, very much and I hope you have a great day.